WTFNN. Headline news update. Hi, everyone. Basil Chapman, Gene the Tiger Financial News Network noon update. I'm the host of the Tiger Technicians Hour, coming up straight after this update. And the Dow's down 162 at 26,178, the 26,487 high of four days ago. Just had a beautiful doji candle. It's usually, I, I, I use just a few candles as markers in my work. And one of them is this plus sign, the little doji, especially if it's a small candle after big candles. And it very often is either a halfway marker on the way in a directional move continuing or it's a reversal candle, and it was a reversal candle with a gap down yesterday. Of course, that was helped by um, that was helped by Boeing being down 18 points. Today, it's down another five points. So we're looking at uh, the 14-period moving average of 26,080 as really key support here on the very short term. Closes under that, and that'll confirm that there is no Chapman Wave instant restart. This is a PE top, at least a near to short-term top. We'll go from there. On the upside, any move back into the 26,400s this week would be very positive. Uh, it's going to be tough to do. S&P. S&P is also down right now. It's down to the Dow's 0.62%. The S&P is down 0.47%, a little better, down 13 at 28.82. It's made a potential peak E here with that high yesterday. Just simply put, if it starts to close under 28.69, the nine period moving average that would suggest that at least a short term top. Now, the QQQ reached <clears throat> within two points, just under two points, no, just over two points of its all time high of 187.53. Yesterday's high was 185.28. Uh, just an eye blink away from making an all time high. This is where you start to see a lot of resistance in the V shaped recovery. Look at the SMHs. The SMH went to. Uh, 112.90 all-time highs, 114.55 dollar 60 away from an all-time high, a miraculous turnaround from the low of 80.71 uh, the last week of December. Really a fantastic comeback. So we're going to be looking at that gold just real quickly, and I'll do a little more in my my show. Gold is up eight. That's very good. 13.10, and the dollar is down commensurate with that counterpoint move. And we will be looking at this a little closer when we get to my show. We want to be looking at crude oil and bonds and stocks. I'll be right back. Hope to see you soon. Otherwise, see you tomorrow.